But it was so good, so good. Hello, we're here at Lincoln Park in Mexico City for their Saturday market. First things first, we need some food. I'm hungry and we're gonna get some food <laughs> in the market there. Yeah, let's go. We're a big fan of tacos with these french fries on them. Super straw like, super uh, skinny. I'm so excited, these look amazing. It was three tacos plus a drink. We haven't tried this drink before, it's called Squirt. Um, and three tacos and that drink for 70 pesos. So, how exciting. Ooh. <laughs> Sensational. <laughs> so good. The meat is soft and juicy. The french fries are crispy. And with all the sauces that I put on it, onion, cilantro. It's like a whole meal. Amazing. We're settled in right on the street side here. This place is crazy <laughs> and so busy. You could barely walk trying to get in here, but we saw this one. We had to stop here. It was the french fries for me. We've now had three types of fries. We've had really thick ones, we've had regular fries, and these ones are like really thin, crispy ones. So I'm excited to see the difference. Mm. Ooh. Charred meat, fresh off the barbecue. Those sauces are really spicy. Mm -hmm. These fries are so crispy. That is really good. Fizzy, limey, very refreshing. It's like a limey almost. Mm, I like that a lot. What a great summertime drink. Son 10 pizzas por 25. 10 for 25. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 We heard through the grapevine that there may not be food, that it's all like crafts and stuff. And when we first entered the area, it was all just crafts and whatnot. And I was like, uh-oh, yeah. this is going to be a problem because we didn't eat. And this is a very like posh area. So everything's quite expensive. And you know how we like street food. So we started walking down and we smelled it. We were like, tacos are in somewhere. the air. It's here. Yeah. But yeah, we both actually, when we saw this one, we were just like, that's the one. That's the one. The way people were eating it, seeing the little french fries. But it was so good. So good. Mm -hmm. I love the little crispy fries on it. Mm -hmm. I never thought I would like french fries on a taco, but... But it's a thing now. That it's has like, changed my taco outlook now. We can never go back. Yeah. <laughs> we only got one of the three tacos and a drink to share because I smelled this. Mm -hmm. They look like teeny tiny pancakes. I wish you could smell this. Mm -hmm. They smell so incredibly delicious it is warm it is got like a little soft crunchy feel to it but it feels almost gooey um and you get 10 of them for 25 pesos so, so that was good. that was a no-brainer it's like a sweet bread kind of pancakey warm crunchy i like it it's really lovely be really good with our coffee later too like you said Every Saturday you can come down here and they've got yeah, little handicraft stalls, they've got prepared food stalls, and you can get all kinds of fruits and vegetables here. Even desserts. It's really special to see all the locals coming together, even in these posh high-end neighborhoods and buying all these local items. So we were gonna get some fruits and vegetables there, but actually there is a Sunday market right like two blocks from our house. So we're actually gonna do a video for you guys tomorrow and show you what that's like. And we're about 40 minutes from home and I didn't feel like carrying veggies and fruits. Yeah, especially when we can get it tomorrow two blocks away. Yeah. So we'll show you that tomorrow yeah. uh, when we go and uh, find some groceries for the week. Yeah. 
place is definitely a fancier area than we've seen in Mexico so far but it is really sweet to see the families out on the weekends and just doing regular family things there's also people doing like little motorized boats on this water here and people walking their dogs and eating and having their afternoon coffees it's really sweet it's really cute Very peaceful yeah we really enjoy that different perspective on Mexico City if you're into that kind of high-end lifestyle meets artsy kind of community vibe take the time to check it out but I would say go on a Saturday because that market with the food and the groceries and stuff that was really fun you kind of get the best of both worlds that way you get the street food the really local type culture but then if you want to shop in those fancy stores they're right there for you it is a lot of like the high-end brand names but if you go down the side streets a little bit there are some really cool artsy stores very creative like very local stuff like not fast fashion and stuff like that but there's also places like Zara if you want to shop there it's it's a nice place to check out it'll give you a different type of view on what Mexico has to offer and if you want to see more street food type videos and you like that part of the video right there <laughs> and if you like more of the museums or like the fancy stuff we have videos like that or if you just liked all of it and like us please do subscribe and we'll see you on the next one bye bye